Okay, this video is to show you how to set up your Google Home with your Tailwind IQ3 system. So uh, we go, we have to start off in the Tailwind app. So we go to the main menu to Integrations. We tap on Integrations. And I don't have any currently set up, so I need to um, tap on the plus sign to add an integration. And we're going to select Google Home. So we select Google Home. And notice it says, when prompted, please use your Tailwind account login credentials during account linking. So that means when we're on the Google side uh, in, uh, in the later steps here, we have to use our Tailwind credentials, which are the ones that we use to log into the Tailwind app. So I add the integration. So it's been added. And then I need to simply set the device because I may have more than one Tailwind. So the system needs to know which one do you want to send the commands to. Uh, so we're going to select on the Tailwind that we have. We have to set a pin. So I'll set the pin up to one, two, three, four. You can set any four-digit pin that you would like and tap Save. There we are. Okay. And so now that's it. The integration is completely set up on uh, the Tailwind side of things. And by the way, the set pin is not used for anything yet uh, with Google Home. But uh, at some point in the future, we, uh, we may be using a pin code. So uh, we're just having that already set into the, uh, into the app so that we're prepared for the future. Okay, so the uh, Tailwind side is finished, and we can now go over to the Google Home side. So here I am in the Google Home um, app. And so now I want to do is uh, go ahead and add Tailwind to it. So I'll tap on Add. I'm going to set up device and I'll set up a works with Google. So we already have something set up, our Tailwind. So we're going to tap on works with Google and we're going to search, use the, uh, the search tool at the top here and search out for Tailwind. There we are. And here's where it's going to ask us to link those accounts together. And so what I need to enter here is my email address and password that I use to log into the Tailwind app. So I'll go ahead and enter that now. Okay, so now I've entered in my email address and my password that I use to log into the Tailwind app. So now that those are entered, I just tap on login. And it is now going to link the Google Home uh, and my Tailwind accounts together. So it's doing the linking. Okay, so now I've got my three garage doors because I have my Tailwind set up to control three garage doors. So those are all there, but there's no room assigned. So I'll tap on each one of them and add to a room. And um, I could create a new room, but I've already got a room called garage. So I could, I could have, uh, originally Garage was down here under Create New, but I've already done it before, so it's already in my room. So I can just tap on Garage and Next. And now it's putting those devices in that room in my home. So there we are, and now I tap Done. And my Google Home is now set up, and I can use my assistant and voice commands to go ahead and uh, control and... Uh, uh, ask Google if uh, if my doors are open or closed.